Hello unlimited friends. Day 9. I want ease and flow on all subjects. I think this is such a good affirmation. Powerful words from Abraham. Absolutely love these words. This is one of my favorite uh, affirmations to write over and over again. I want ease and flow on all subjects. Because the desire for having things come easily on all subjects, not just on one subject, on every aspect of my life, having ease and flow is so important. It is, hi Nancy, it is what we truly want. And the reason it's so important is because if we just keep it general, and we ask the universe to bring us everything that we want, we never have to become specific. Hi, Jennifer. Hi, Moni. So that is the important thing, is to not become specific, to stay general. Because in staying general, there is no attachment. So when we are general, we never have to worry about creating attachment to anything or any specific thing that we want to manifest or accomplish, we never have to wonder about it because we're asking for all of it and all of it is possible. So that is the reason why I find asking for ease and flow on all subjects as a really good way to practice law of attraction with knowing full well that there's no attachment to the way we are doing it. Hi, Mary Ellen. So, um, so think about it. You see, attachment is the biggest thing that gets in the way of our being able to manifest the things that we want. Happy Easter to you as well, Mary Ellen. Yes, see? attachment to the outcome. I want this specific thing. I want this person. I want this person to behave in a certain way. I want my work to be this way. I want to manifest this amount of money. So what happens is when we set goals like that, those are specific goals. And when we set specific goals like that, we start looking for the result. Where is that money? If if the universe tells us everything is possible and all my wishes are granted, then where's that money that I asked for? Where's that relationship? Why aren't things happening the way I want them to? And if you're asking a question like that, the answer is it is because you are being too specific. You're looking for the results. And looking for results is attachment. So when we say, I want ease and flow on all subjects, there's no attachment in that because there's nothing specific to be attached to. There's no timeline. We haven't said, I must have this by this date. We haven't said, I want it in this quantity. We haven't said, it has to be this color, this height, this weight. We haven't specified anything. We've just said, universe, you know what I want and I want it to come to me through ease and flow. Ease and flow, like water, like water has ease and flow. Water always finds its way. If water is flowing and there's a rock on its path, water doesn't get stranded there and ask the rock to move, water just goes around it. Ease and flow. When I think of ease and flow, I think of water. <coughs> so much ease and flow, right? So we never really need to put into words for the universe to know what we want. Because the universe is privy to every little preference. The preference to move 
this one thing from here to here on the table is a preference and the universe is listening even to that. So we never have to express things in exact terms because when we actually express things in exact terms, we create attachment to the outcome and we never ever need to do that. So that's what today's affirmation is all about. So over to you guys. Does anyone have a question for me this afternoon? <laughs> 